Hi everyone, Taino Nadiandi here and today I will share you how to create a drip text effect in Canva. So first uh, just go to type uh, to text I mean and then add heading and I will use the bebas new in bold alright reduce the line spacing and then I will change the alignment to the left I still have to reduce the line spacing here all right I think it's enough and then go to element add shape let's uh, fill it with yellow color this yellow I mean and then increase the size and send send it to back okay and then change the color of the text to white i will increase this height all right and then go to element and uh, just type drip here Okay, you can use this drip. We will make a drip frame. I will use this one. Change the color to white. And then place it here. And then duplicate and I will paste here. Let's use this one, dripping liquid silhouette. All right, I will change the, the color to white. Okay, let's place it here. And then, in fact, I will place it here. Okay, I think it's enough and then I will add a square in white to reduce the size of yellow surface and then okay let's skip it and then download it as PNG now add a new page in black and then upload this png here and then go to edit photo scroll down click here i will refer to the old editor go to edit image and choose bg remover okay and then apply so now we have a frame a custom frame and then crop it a little now let's add the splash paint color right i'm preparing it here the first is blood and splash of orange paint okay and then let's just make it rectangle place here all right Okay. and then send it to back all right and then i will use the this green the name is green paint splash remove the background the white color by bg remover 
okay tap apply wait until it become a check mark okay done and then i will rotate it i will make it like this all right Okay, and then add the other color. This is the purple. Edit image, remove the white color. Okay, tap apply, and then I will rotate it. I'll make it like this. okay now let's uh, go to position layers and then move the frame to the top and then go to edit image and choose shadow and choose glow okay for the size of this text i want uh, i will not change anything and then tap apply okay and then this is a uh, like white and I don't like it so let's uh, make some change here okay I think it's uh, enough so now let's cover all the area outside the frame with the yellow shape okay cover it duplicate this here so now let's download this page to as png and then add a new page i will add uh, black metal background i will use this one black stainless steel mesh background let's make it a background and then edit image and go to adjust and then reduce the brightness okay and then upload the page to here and go to edit image and then remove the background okay let's see here that is something uh, left here the yellow we can manual erase all right let's check the other and it's okay and then tap done tap apply Okay, I think it can be blur. Alright, it's better. So now you have the drip text effect, and you can also add the white curve element in the graphic. Uh, I mean this one and then click this three dots and see more like this let's try with this one this one white curve and neon line let's flip it horizontal
Let's see. Click it. Okay, I think it's enough and so this is the tutorial. See you next video and have fun with Canva.